Hey guys, Bob Boy here. I just want to give an update video of today. Uh, today I had, a, uh, well actually today I had two job interviews today, surprisingly. Uh, so the story was, uh, yesterday I made a video saying I had a job interview at a place called Francesca's. It's a store in the mall, kind of like woman's boutique store and all that. And I got an email this morning saying that I was uh, moving forward in the interview with the place called Buckle. As many of you guys know, I made a video a while back couple of years ago about talking about my shopping at Buckle and people are talking about it. it's like basically it's an expensive clothing store they have pants up there they have clothes up there somewhere between like $50 up until like $200 but personally I definitely love the store I love the stuff in it uh so I applied there back in 2019 when I was still looking for a job didn't get cho chosen to move on but I um got an email this morning saying hey you would like to move before an interview calls at this number so I did it was supposed to be scheduled for Thursday at one o'clock but I went to the mall uh, today, 12.30, 1 o'clock, and did an interview at Francesca's. And the lady said, uh, if I did work there, expect somewhere between 6 to 15 hours a week. I'm thinking that's not going to even help me get by with the bills to pay. So, so I went to, um, I, went, I stopped by Buckle. I was going to pick up a new band suit, but I wanted to stop by Buckle and ask um, if I can get do an interview possibly right now. So I don't have to think because guess it's fucking expensive things with the fucking Democrats, but... Uh, I went in there, asked him if I had, can have an interview with the late lady instead of doing it right now. So today, she goes, okay, let me get her. So she's like, yeah, we can do the interview today. And so basically, if I get a job there, I can at least get 15 to 20 hours a week, which that's good. But most of them work off commission, which means that they, she said that they get paid $8 an hour and get 3% of commission. So if pants cost $60, the person to sell them to you is going to get $1.95 pretty much. So... And I've seen people work off commission before. And there have been people, when I worked at the shoe store, before I started working there, they would work on, they would get minimum wage and commission. So they would get their minimum wage and hourly, and also whatever they got on commission. I did believe when I was working there, they was like 7% of commission. So, and I think that's not too bad because I expect if I work 11, if I work 15 hours a week, that's somewhere between a couple dollars. Uh, at least a hundred, hundred dollars. So I said, okay, maybe that'll work. And the lady was really, really nice. I knew who she was. I shoved a buckle many a time. So she even knew my name and didn't even know any of me. So, uh, so if I did get the job at Buckle, I would have to wait till the first week of July. So I'm just saying I got to find a job ASAP because I'm not working in the shit old town I live in because this town has done nothing for me but treat me like shit. So why should I get back into this fucking community and work for them? Not happening. So... Hopefully I hear something back, but luckily I had two interviews today, one place called Francesca's and one called The Buckle. Personally, if I had to choose, I'd rather take The Buckle job over The Francesca's because somewhere I can work 6 to 15 hours a week, which that's not even worth the drive. So Buckle, I can work a 15, a 15 to 20 hours a week. That I can do. I can work three 5-hour shifts, which that's possible, doable, and I would get $8 an hour. And uh, three percent of commission, and I'm pretty decent to shoes. So, and plus, I know the store. I know like eighty-five percent of that store. So, I know what types they sell: uh, BKE pants, Rock Revivals, Afflictions, uh, American Fighter, uh, other stuff as well. So, I can't think of the top of my head, but those are the main popular things that I want to get this up to the videos. And hey, I did two job interviews today, so thumbs up for that. And I will give an update. I probably, I haven't recorded any other videos. I try. I actually my PC. Uh, kind of like shut down on me i restarted it and it would load up perfectly fine boot up fine it would shut the mouse and it'll be a tired black screen i sat there for like 10 minutes and it did nothing turn it off did it again a couple times same thing so i restarted the entire pc luckily all my files were already saved so i was kind of worried that i would have to reinstall honey pop 2 i would lose all the footage from the gameplay video and then I would have to start the game over if I was. I said, fuck that, not doing that again. But luckily, all the video, uh, the video, the videos I recorded for Honey Pop 2 finale um, have, are still saved on my computer. And when I installed Honey Pop 2 again, it was still the same. So it should be good to go. Continue that off. So, but I, uh, I may do another uh, video of Doki Doki exit music sometime this week. I'm not 100% sure. And, uh, but other than that, doing all right. Uh, so hopefully, I hear something back. So, anyway. Just want to give it a heads up saying hello. Today was alright. So, anyway, thank you guys a lot for watching. I'll see you all in a future video. Take it easy.